Hey guys, what's up? I'm here with a Shattered Goho replay. Um, kind of a lower base, but you know, as part of your job at a clan, you gotta pick some easy bases to clean up as well. So this is a variation of the Tesla moat base where people brought the moat in. So I believe it's called, and it's uh, to separate that middle section for your troops. Um, the double spots, sometimes there's bombs up here. And on this variation, they leave a big spot down here that I'm guessing has some bombs. Um, usually, Teslas are right next to the town hall, so I'm guessing Tesla's there. And it's a deep CC pull. So my plan of attack is to force my troops in the south southern section and hopefully get both those heroes. Um, bring a golem in up there and there. That will collect the splash. And then I can wall break here, put a jump here, and get my troops in. I want to pull the CC out to get it going early and also test these upper areas. So you'll notice I'll bring a hog in up here. It detonates a bomb. So I'm assuming that's probably the other double bomb section. Because um, you'll see in the beginning I noticed I set off two bombs here. But he actually it's a single and there's a bomb there. I could have brought another troop in over here to set off that bomb. Small thing I could have cleaned up on, uh, otherwise to a beautiful attack. Let's take a look at the troops down here, and when you see this base, this is how it should be ran. I've ran this base a few times. Uh, I bring 25 hogs, 2 golems, some wall breakers, my giants, whiz, 3 heals, and a jump. And it works out perfect. Um, so that's the plan. Let's just watch it. Simple attack on a pretty common internet base. So you see I bring in my golems, and my troops start cutting that funnel. As they're cutting the funnel, you'll notice I use minimal amount of wizards. So you can have some cleanup wizards and power wizards for the interior. So I'm cleaning up that funnel pretty good. Bring in my wall breakers. Boom. And my troops right up the center there. Look at what this wall breaker does. This is another point of why I bring extra wall breakers. A lot of times when I blow up a middle section, my wall breakers run through. You'll see it on a lot of videos. They set off interior traps, and it works out perfect. That's two bombs gone. Now put in your mind there's only two other bombs. you got to assume four Teslas are there. So your other two bombs, there's probably a double set somewhere up there. So when I bring in my hog to clear out that CC, I set off one bomb. Now I know three bombs are gone. I am assuming in my mind the other one's there. It's not, but works out great. So does me double duties. I set off a bomb and I get that CC pull coming down to my troops. Now as the CC pull comes down, I have tons of troops cleaning up everything. I make sure that jump gets into the queen and into the interior. Poison up those CC troops to slow them down, so hopefully my power can push them down before they even get started. I bring in one giant to collect some fire and throw down my hoglay. Bring in another giant to collect some fire. And bring in some more hogs. My heroes and power troops are kind enough to take care of both of the heroes and everything down below. Bring in my next hogs. You can see those heels coming in. A little bit of a mistake is there's a bomb as my heels finishing up. But my hogs are still in the heel and they come out pretty clean. Throw out my cleanup troops. Now my hogs just have like two defenses take down. And then they can turn around and punch all those skellies following them. They do that with ease. Now I got my entire pack of hogs. Cleanup troops running around. Popular internet base down the drain again. So there you go, guys. Hope that makes sense. Short video. Not a hard base, but when you see it, you'll see this base a lot. The plan works. And a lot of times with that interior and that jump, you're lucky enough to get all the heroes and everything down below. And that's what happened, and it worked out great. So hope to see you guys next time.